Happy Thursday, Sunset family and others that may be viewing this video as we come in here on this 17th day of the official CDC guidelines that we've been under and uh, have a few more to go. So I hope this uh, video finds you and your family doing well, coping okay, and just uh, uh, maintaining and, and doing the things you need to do to keep safe and keep your family safe in this community, uh, this state, and this country. So thanks for the part that you're doing. I asked Carrie the other day, I said, what do you think would be a good uh, uh, topic for today? And she said, well, why don't you do something that doesn't have anything to do with what we're talking about right now? And that's a good thought, but we're coming to you this way because of what's going on right now. But I think in all of this, we just got to think of the goodness that... Uh, that we see around us. Uh, and, and I'm sure you've seen some goodness. I was talking to one of our members on the uh, phone the other day, and he had been to the uh, store earlier that day and had picked up some of the things that he needed, including some toilet paper. Um, so he said he had taken and loaded the stuff up in his car and uh, had pushed the cart back into the store and then was walking out to get in his car and he said there was a lady that pulled up uh, kind of alongside him and rolled down her window and said, uh, hey, I see you're walking out with, without anything. Um, were you looking for toilet paper? Do you need some toilet paper? She said, I just picked up a, a package at, uh, I think she said Walmart, I don't remember what he said, and I'll be willing to share it with you. And he said, no, I'm good. I've already loaded things in the car, but that stuck with him. And he shared that story with me this afternoon or the day that I talked to him. And um, I'm sure you guys have, have had some feel good stories like that, where um, good things are happening. People are good. Uh, most of all, God is good. And that's what I wanted to kind of focus on today. I'm going to share a song with you here in a little bit. God is so good. Um, one that you're familiar with. But I, before I do that, I want to share with you 17 verses. And these are just small readings, so it won't take a long time. But I thought since we're on day 17, 17 verses describing the goodness of God. These are just in a random order, no uh, particular order here. But listen, and, and just listen as I read these. The Lord, the Lord God, merciful and gracious, long-suffering, and abounding in goodness and truth, Exodus 34, 6. Oh, give thanks to the Lord, for he is good, for his mercies endure forever, 1 Chronicles 16, 34. And they sang responsively, praising and giving thanks to the Lord, for he is good, his mercy endures forever, Ezra 3, 11. Good and upright is the Lord. Psalm 25, 8. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Psalm 23, 6. The Lord is good to all, and his tender mercies are over all his work. Psalm 145, 9. No one is good but one. That is God. Mark 10, 18. Every good gift and every perfect gift is from above and comes down from the Father of lights, with whom there is no variation or shadow of turning. James 1.17 If you then, being evil, know how to give good gifts to your children, how much more will your Father, who is in heaven, give good things to those who ask him? Matthew 7.11 I would have lost heart unless I had believed that I would see the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living, Psalm 27, 13. I will meditate on the glorious splendor of your majesty and on your wondrous works. Men shall speak of the might of your awesome acts, and I will de declare your greatness. They shall utter the memory of your great goodness and shall sing of your righteousness, Psalm 145, 5 through 7. He loves righteousness and justice. The earth is full of the goodness of the Lord. Psalm 33, 5. O oh, taste and see that the Lord is good. Blessed is the man who trusts in him. Psalm 34, 8. Be thankful to him and bless his name. For the Lord is good. 
His mercy is everlasting. Psalm 100, 4 through 5. Oh, that men would give thanks to the Lord for his goodness and for his wonderful works to the children of men. For he satisfies the longing soul and he fills the hungry soul with goodness. Psalm 107, 8 and 9. As a father pities his children, so the Lord pities those who fear him. For he knows our frame. He remembers that we are dust, Psalm 103, 13 and 14. And finally, teach me to do your will, for you are my God. Your spirit is good. Lead me in the land of uprightness, Psalm 143 and verse 10. We're in day 17. That was 17 verses. We've got more days to come, but you know there are many, many, many more verses in scripture that talk about the goodness of God. And that's what I want you to think about today. Let's sing this song together. I know some of you commented you enjoyed singing along last week. This is one that you know. Uh, thought it was kind of interesting as I looked at this song, four verses, uh, God is so good, he's so good to me. Verse two, he answers prayer, he's so good to me. Verse three, he cares for me, he's so good to me. And then verse four is our part, I love him so. Think about that as we sing through. God is so good, God is so good, God is so good, he's so good to me, he answers prayer, he answers prayer, he answers prayer, He's so good to me. He cares for me. He cares for me. He cares for me. He's so good to me. I love him so. I love him so, I love him so, he's so good to me. Just think about the goodness of God today, and as you have opportunity today, be good to someone else. Love you guys and look forward to seeing you soon.